So if this is the library homepage, how do you decide what to click on? The central box is a good place to start if you don't know what all the other links are. The search box here covers much of what Penfield has access to, all of our books and physical media like CDs and DVDs, plus many of the articles we subscribe to from journals, magazines, and newspapers. That makes it good for interdisciplinary research, or if you just don't know where else to look. But just below the search box, there's this button, Resources by Subject. If you're tired of wading through 20 zillion results, check out Resources by Subject. This will give you recommendations for the best specialized databases to search. So if you're doing research for math, you'd want to check out the link for math here. But we're currently in a computer science class, so let's take a look at the computer science link. These are some databases that contain only materials on one specific topic. Searching these will get you many fewer, but much more focused, results than searching from the library homepage or on Google. So what else can you do on the library homepage? You can share your research papers free online in Oswego DL, or check out some of the historical materials housed here. You can get free access to books, movies, articles, and more that Penfield doesn't own using Interlibrary Loan. You can check whether your prof made your textbook freely available in the library in course reserves. You can learn how to create your own multimedia projects and get access to video cameras, mics, and more for free from the library. Or you can find your perfect study space. And of course, as I have mentioned before, you can always get expert assistance in navigating all of this. Just ask a librarian.